previously on Lost Judgment. Hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna force choke these uh, kids here. Watch this, guys. Come over here, kid. That's right. I'm your goddamn homeroom teacher. You will treat me with respect, you little assholes. Now ragdoll for me. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> and now back to Lost. <laughs> Mr. Kitty, what are you doing here? <laughs> well, get out of here, okay? You've been replaced. This is Mr. Doggy. Bork? <laughs> Bork. Yeah, see, he's way more agreeable than you are. Is that right, Mr. Doggy? Bork, bork. <gasps> Mr. Kitty, put the gun down. Put the gun down, Mr. Kitty. Bork, bork. Ah, Mr. Doggy, put the gun down as well. <laughs> bork, bork, bork. Oh, God. Why are you both pointing him towards me? What did I do? Why am I the only one without a gun? Bork. Ah! Oh, God, they're working together now. Ah! Sneak up B. Back with some more Lost Judgment. We last left off. Finally. <laughs> Finally saw us since they told us what the fuck was going on. And uh, to not a big surprise, uh, yes, uh, Mikishiba was, in fact, uh, a crazy psycho or a piece of shit bully to, uh, to Ihara's son. Meaning, <laughs> well, probably kind of deserved the death that he received, right? Which definitely leads to a, an interesting moral quandary of this game, which I, I do kind of appreciate, you know? It's kind of like, not just the fact that, it's not like Ihara is necessarily just straight fucking evil or something, but that he wanted that vengeance, like that actual like payback to somebody who would have caused the caused them to lose a loved one, right? Um, and it just a, the most horrible way. It's like anybody I think can sympathize with that, that feeling, right? They're like, oh my God, that fucking, that rage, right? Though I don't think we know quite yet how he figured out uh, his son was, or that Mikashiba was the one responsible for it. I imagine we'll probably learn that when we go to uh, to uh, interview him here in a bit. But I am really liking the main story of this game, you know? I, I'm, I'm liking everything about this game so far, actually. It's probably still a bit too early to say, do I like it better than the last game? Um, well, well, actually, no, I probably say I am actually enjoying it more than the last game simply because it does not have the Kai and Gang thing. Just just having not having it here like already make, makes it better, <laughs> right? Just like right off the bat. Um, but the side content in this game is really good. I think the side content of the previous game was also pretty good for the most part. Um, which, by the way, you guys did also inform me. So, uh, yes, in regards to the girlfriend events, uh, apparently they are supposed to be better this time. I actually think I remember you guys telling me that before, but uh, not in the way I think I was thinking. So better, I think, in terms of the actual content of the uh, of like the events with the girlfriends. I didn't really have that much of a problem with the actual story events with the girlfriend ones. It's just that there were so many of them and they took a while, right? Uh, and then also at the end, it was kind of like you were kind of a piece of shit because you dated like five girls. Apparently this game doesn't actually give you a choice if you're like going out with the girl like you basically by the end you will pick the girl it's just it's just how it goes which means Yagami still ends up being a uh, a cheating piece of shit but I don't know I guess you guys said it's better so I'm guessing maybe the stories around it were maybe better I think that I think the problem I think was that some of them went a bit too long uh in the last game like they just they got dragged out a little too much but I don't know if they would say they were inherently bad it was just a fucking lot of them and if you're someone who tries to do everything in the game it can it can take a lot of time. Which is why I'm going to definitely try my best to spread it out here as much as possible. Fortunately, it does seem like we have... I think last game we had like five girlfriends. And this one we only seemed to have four. And hilariously enough, the one we ran into was actually a, not a base game girlfriend. It was actually one of the DLC girlfriends. Really? Oh, okay. I think you guys said maybe the, the, old, the base girlfriend maybe comes through just like obligatory uh, progression of the story. Maybe. And maybe all the the DLC ones are like uh, side story subcases, maybe if I understood that correctly. Which, by the way, in that regard, uh, last episode, uh, Cardinal said, <laughs> "Me and Judgment tearing up over main characters dying. Me and Lost Judgment tearing up over a cat stalking a lady down the street." <laughs> I know, right? They were like, "Whoa!" <laughs> you thought this was like, just like, ah, oh, look at this. It's just a cat. I was just following you, and then it's like, let me tell you about my deep, dark, dank lore, <laughs> lady. You're like, oh, okay. Let me tell you about my owner beforehand was the doctor. He tried to save people and she's fucking dead now. And now I, I'm following you because I think you smell like her. You remind me of my last owner. <laughs> Love me. <laughs> it's like, holy, holy shit, Mr. Kitty. Jesus, take it down a couple of notches, bro. God damn. It was surprisingly uh, sweet, but also surprisingly uh, soul crushing too. But the lady seemed nice at least. So I, I do at least look forward to trying to make it to know her a little bit better. 
Um, but Cardinal, thank you so much for your hilarious and accurate comment. And here's that reason you are comment of the day. By the way, in regards to uh, Akase, uh, the, the girl we met, uh, apparently though, sadly, out of everybody's uh, in the game, at least according to you guys, she's probably one of the more annoying ones to actually try to go on a date with. And it's not that her events are annoying, it's that just being able to do to, to go out with her is annoying. Because I, I was wondering, I was like, where is she? I can't actually find her. She doesn't seem to be in the nurse's office. So apparently you can only go on a date with her or initiate a date with her when it's daytime, but not this daytime, not orange daytime, like like white light daytime. If it's this time of day, it's too late. Um, and then apparently like it's like you say you, you start a date in the daytime and then you can only like finish that date in, at nighttime. So, like, yeah, it's like this weird kind of jumping between times of day in order to actually progress with her. You can't just, you just can't, like, uh, like grind hers out in, like, a single day. Uh, unless you're in post-game where you can change the time of day whenever you want. Well, that fucking sucks. Damn. Well, then I might already be screwed. I don't know how many more, like, changes in the time of day we're going to have in the main story. I mean, granted, we're still, like, I think we're on Chapter 4, right? So, I mean, I guess there are probably still going to be a few more. I imagine there's at least going to be, like, 10 maybe 12 chapters in this game. That's kind of usually what, what we get get to. But uh, uh, I don't know, man. That's that's kind of rough for that. I, I really would prefer not to not to have to save it to, for post-game. Actually, if that happens, I probably just won't do it. I, I probably just won't see the end of it. I'll go as far as I fucking can, but I only say it because I really don't want to end the last episode uh, on anything but the final confrontation like I usually do. I, I don't like usually doing like the Adventure Time post game because all that usually is is just like you did you miss some shit go back and do it it's not like it that doesn't usually make it so you have to do things in post game but the way this one's set up it does seem like it could make it a little awkward so anyway the next time we get a bright white light daytime I'm gonna immediately uh, run over there and start her thing and we'll do our best all right we'll do our best with hers I don't know if anyone else has weird uh prerequisites like she does hopefully not it's not like she was probably the the worst offender or the one that at least could create the most problems oh right also in regards to that squirrel i found so apparently the reason why that didn't show up on my mini map was the number next to it It had a two next to it apparently some of the squirrels are seeming kind of like tied to each other so i'm guessing maybe i think maybe this one had a one on it and then this one was a two so like it was it was sort of close by so I guess maybe they like come in pairs or threes, maybe or something. I don't, I don't know the rules of the squirrels yet. I haven't learned it. I haven't learned enough about the dank squirrel lore to piece this together. But okay, all right. It, it's kind of weird. I feel like I don't know why they. And I'm still gonna have to probably come back here and look at these again. So I don't know why it wouldn't just let me like mark the uh, seemingly the minor ones, even if they're tied to the other ones. I, I don't know, man. Man, whatever. May all just make sense when I when I fucking get there, whenever that is. Which, May not happen until I'm fucking dead at the rate we're going. Um, but anyway, uh, so we're definitely gonna be continuing more main story. I definitely wanna go talk with Ihara. However, I figured I probably should maybe do, uh, maybe at least one side story to, again, help spread things out. Uh, and we've had this one that's been sitting here for a while. I'm thinking maybe this could also be another girlfriend event. I was just kind of me guessing, um, seeing as they seem to now be littering the, uh, the world here. And, <gasps> ah! oh my God lucky day oh i can already tell this is gonna be a good episode yeah what does it mean i don't know but i'm saving you for later mr squirrel i'm gonna find out uh oh ah dinner must be a bad day fuck you man screw this shit dude stop blocking what do you think this is yaksa three you motherfucker ow ow eh, eh, your kicks hurt Woo! Yeah. Look what I can do. Woo! Now let's just get hit by that. Come on. Don't be a dick. There we go. You're a piece of shit. Fuck you. Ugh, I'm gonna kick you in auto gummy traffic. Okay, I wanna go see what... Oh, wait. Oh, no. It's it's my... Uh, it's my uh, dude friend again. Thought I was done with you, bro. Are we doing more Pier Paradise VR stuff? I'm guessing so. I guess I am a little long cash anyway. Yeah, I got me. Yeah, I got me. Uh... I think actually, I think I ended up giving him a, uh, I think I thought he was a thug, but I actually think, I think I actually gave him this voice. So, yo, Yagami, you check, you, you check out Dice and Cube Lady? Those upgrades I mentioned are fully implemented now. Oh, uh, yeah, you did say something about that. What exactly did you change? Hey, you'll see when you put the heads, put on the headset. Swing by venue and try it. Okay, will do. What? Again? 
I guess he, uh, that's true. I guess he said he was gonna do some stuff. Do I, I'm getting, I'm guessing this was not free though, is it? Hey, Ultra Marathon Man, go me. I guess I'll check. I don't know if I have enough, uh, passes to do whatever the, to, to do this though. Whoa, hey, wait, nope. Maybe he'll let me in. Oh, Yagami Son, you here to play again? Uh. Yeah, I heard there's been some upgrades. Remember how I was saying this game needed a roster of badasses? I do. Did you put some in there? Oh. I put a carry. <laughs> ah, shit. Hell yeah, I did. Thanks to my creative genius, business has been booming like crazy. We got a ton of players. They can't stop talking about which new character is their favorite. Uh. Wow. I ain't mentioned it. I do see a lot more players in here. <laughs> you do? <laughs> there are actually other people in here? That was just me. Uh, I'm just going to mention this ahead of time. So these characters might seem pretty familiar. Mm -hmm. Familiar how? Oh, God. Go, oh, God, please. Please do not say it's fucking Kai and gang members. If it is, I will fucking kill you. I'll I will plug you into the matrix and then fucking rip you back out of it and leave you a lifeless husk, you piece of crap. <laughs> well, it's based off people you know. Uh, can I explain? So here's the thing. I have some designs to flesh out the characters, but I had to skip the concept of my face. The cost for me was way too high. <laughs> we don't really have the budget to design a bunch of dudes from scratch, you know? But then I had an epiphany. What if I just use photos of people I know? People who look dope in the game. Okay, and I assume you got their permission. You do know about pub publicity rights, yes? <laughs> like like the company that owns me. <laughs> huh? Nah, I didn't fuck with all that. Yeah, otherwise, they they come ask for royalties some horse shit. <sighs> Not good, Tashiro Kun. You know I'm a lawyer, right? Oh, right. The other thing you guys help remind me of, because I always fucking forget, is that Yagami wasn't fired. He's literally just stepped away from his job, and he's free to go back whenever the fuck he wants. So yes, he's still free to have his badge and technically he's still a lawyer. So, right, I always fucking forget. I've definitely made that mistake probably at least three times now. Look, if you just play the game, you'll see why I did what I did. Anyway, try and defeat every challenger on the roster. As if you have the guts. Uh, and he's gone. Please choose your course. Uh, God damn it, I don't. Fuck me. How many do I have? Well, I got one free pass voucher. I've got two. Um. God damn it. I might I might be able to get one from the skateboarding shop. If I have enough points for it. Hold up. Hold up. Oh god damn. You guys are just out here waiting for me? Get out of here. Middle of something. You motherfuckers. No, don't you drink that shit, mother. <laughs> Tosh was there like, holy shit! Yeah, I miss out. What? You've seen me fight all the time. I remember I beat you up at one point. I know. That's why I'm getting fucking PTSD, man. Sorry. I can. All right. All right. Well, let's see what I got. I have 139,000. So what I am getting from this? <laughs> to be honest, I'm kind of surprised there's actually another quest tied to this. I really wasn't planning to use the Paradise VR much for like the remainder of the game, if possible. Like just, you know, just get money from what I usually uh, get with. Uh, uh, did I just pass by the place? Uh, no, wait. From doing uh, regular shit. But god damn it, that Paradise VR just keeps pulling me back. <laughs> Seriously, there's nobody else in here. What the fuck are you talking about, Yagami? There's literally no one else in here. This clearly looks like it used to be a dance club, by the way. I'm the only one that goes here. I feel like I'm playing Kingdom Hearts again where I'm like, look at the imaginary audience. All right, fighting against a strong rival? Yes. Oh, Kaido. <laughs> Virtual Higashi. Virtual Sug Sugiera. Hey, look, it's me. Fast ride with the slickest threads in town. Look forward to seeing to some awe-inspiring skills. Uh, Ryan, Tanaga. Wow, okay, even so that's Mr. Try and Hit Me guy. Uh, and since I, these guys are all going to show up again then. All right, I, I had a feeling, I mean, we had Ryan already sort of confirm with that one quest. But it looks like these two are very likely going to show up again at some point. Probably in a side story. Okay, who do I want to go with? I might as well just go with him. All right, I'll fight you. Since this is your quest. Now don't be a bitch and let me win. Yosh. Yosh. Let's see you back, Sonny. Make a lot of money and drink some damn good booze, boy. Damn, boy. All right. 29 spaces. So I remember how this shit goes again. So seemingly the same course. Event. Burr, 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 burr. About using only snake style. All right, I can do that. Ugh. Oh, right, 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 right. The unarmed move. I was like, how do I do that? Yeah, that's right. Gotta do the timing thing. Oh, 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 oh holy shit. That was amazing. I don't think I've seen that one yet. Dope.
And anyway, I got a thousand SP from that too. Nice. All right, 15 bucks. I'll take it. Oh shit, he's coming. Hey, I land on the same spot. Okay, so since it's the rival, it's time for a rival battle. Go ahead and hit it with your rival and settle the score. If you or your rival land in the same space, a rival battle will start. Each of you will then roll the dice. Clones will join each fighter based on their dice roll. Uh, minus one. The battle ends when you or your rival is defeated, not counting clones, or time is up. The player who loses the battle will skip their turn. Any health lost on your side will not be recovered. Uh, holy shit! Get fucked, Tashiro! Let's go! Oh, I see. Multiple versions of him! It's like there's multiple versions of me! My army of Yagamis! <laughs> Alright, that's it. Punch! 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 Now, well, they can even change their styles too. Motherfucker! Whoa! Okay, that guy's dead. Holy! Okay, that's it. You come here! You come here! It's horrible! Oh, you're still alive. Bulk. Yeah, fuck you. I take your rivals, and I believe oh, they're too busy to heal up. Oh, right. Yeah, so then I guess they're, like, out of commission for a little bit. All right. Let's go. All right. Yeah, big, big number. What are the stars again? Oh, that's like, oh, that's if you get stars or lose stars. So, yeah, just go this way. Okay, so he's just out of commission. All right, I guess I'll go ahead and just give myself a roll uh, change. So, yeah, seemingly, I guess as you beat, like, other characters, I think you just get their skills for yourself. Like, permanently. Okay, uh... Two. Three. Parkour challenge. Climb the wall. Oh, boy. <laughs> it's dropping people. Oh, I see a real special one here. It's like super. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ow. Okay, it didn't immediately kill me, at least. Just go. Just go. Deluxe sandwich. All right, I'm definitely not getting anything too crazy right now, so... Maybe just that first one, I got, like, a bunch. And then I have to, like, probably progress the later courses to get, like, even bigger money or whatever. Fuck you, Tashiro. Turn skip for you. Okay, I will go this way and take a nice gift. 3,000. Yeah, I'm definitely not getting much from this. I'm also not seeing King Corin Yon or anything anywhere. Oh, this piece of shit. No, I do that to you. You're not supposed to do that to me. Okay, got some luxury... Bento. I'm just gonna sit here and twiddle my thumbs. Oh my god, you failed the drone mission? How the fuck did you manage to pull that off, Tashiro? You have to actively try to fail those. I'm getting some low ass fucking numbers. Kind of parkour again. Alright. Did a lot better that time. Oh fuck you. Holy shit. And then suddenly 300k. Okay. I will definitely take that. I need to skip. I need to skip this guy's turn again. Oh fuck, he's getting close. He's right on my ass now. Yeah, get some pocket tissues, motherfucker. Also, stay back. I said, stay back. <laughs> like a whine in the whining their arms. All right, my turn. Oh, man, it really sucked if you lost your turn again, Tashiro. Oh, man, that sucks, dude. Wow. What happened? Another iron plate. I'll take it. Man, fuck you, Yagami-san. You're the one who wanted this, Tashiro. You wanted this. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. Come on, Tash. All right. So I was like, I'm about to be like, this is a pretty me meager offering until I got this thing at the end. I got a clear prize. 
Nice. Extra orbs permissions you knocked out. Oh, yeah. Uh, gives a gold for your rival. Holy shit. Skills three times. Gives a gold within seven turns. Don't take damage. All right. Lock some skills. Cool. What'd I get? Is he going to tell me? Uh, hug bomb. I don't think he... <laughs> I don't think he told me. I think, I think the same thing happened before where it's like, you got a new skill. You don't, you can't see what it is until I guess the next time you play, which is kind of weird. Hot damn it, I can't believe you defeated virtual me too. I oh, admit, I didn't expect to see the producer himself in the game. Ah, come on, I'm the most badass character there is. Well, you do have a badass attitude, I'll give you that. You're the first old golden Yakuza I've ever seen. Ex Yakuza, I should say. <laughs> so I guess you're an average citizen decked out in a Yakuza bling. Ah, I ain't no average citizen, bitch. You saying I'm a nobody unless I'm with a family? Mm. I nah, just feel like the old Tashiro Kun had something to fight for. Something that set him apart. He should try something new. Create the next wave of fashion. Try painting in the shadows on your body and show off with a backless shirt. <laughs> Dude, that shit ain't fashion. That's just goddamn nonsense. Say that for an actual Yaksa game. Besides, I already got a new outfit. These threads I'm rocking right now, custom Italian fabric, baby. <laughs> Bitch. Custom, huh? I'll bet that wasn't cheap. Oh. Damn right it ain't cheap. Shit cost me three fucking mil for the set. <laughs> Three million yen? I guess it pays to be a producer, huh? I mean, dude, I get money just from playing this dumb game. Yeah. Nah, it pays pretty average at best. I'm actually pay making monthly payments on these. Three million is still a hefty price tag, even with when broken up month to month. Yeah, well, the power of fashion, fashion can build me. I'll do anything for the sake of fashion, man. <laughs> <laughs> at least you're upfront about it. Oh, I gotta beat all of them for this one to get complete. Okay, well, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a long term one then. This does seem to be the last of the Paradise VR one, seeing as this is uh, kind of going in order here. At least likely. God, I gotta be every one of them. There's a fucking lot of dudes, man. It's only gonna involve a lot of farming for play passes until I get the free ones. But for right now, this is fucking fine. All right, I'm in no rush. All right, let's do the X Blasting Kick. Blast the enemy away with powerful kicks as they bounce off the ground. Uh, R1, triangle after a square, triangle, triangle combo. I'll have to try that. Let's just go try it now while I still remember. Square, triangle, triangle. Hey, guys, what's up? Hey, look what I can do. Whoa! Whoa! That was dope. You like that, motherfucker? I got some for everybody. Punk. All right, let's go ahead and head back to uh, Yokohama 99. Oh, my God, I see a doggo. Whoop, whoop. Oh, my God. Doggo acquired. I've been waiting fucking. Well, how many episodes are there? 16 episodes of this shit for this? Hmm? Hmm? What's up with this dog? <laughs> it's always gotta be a Shiba, right? Oh, uh, I love you already. Hey, what's wrong? You lose your owner? Ah, oh, doggo big sad. Oh. Well, Yagamishi, it appears you finally met the infamous detective dog of Ijinjo. Mm hmm? Sorry, the, the what? Worst been getting around town of an odd dog who apparently wanders the streets looking for cases to solve. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> of course. Why Why wouldn't he? Whenever he gets to the center of a mystery of a crisis, he calls out to nearby people, alerting them of a nearby a nearby incident. <laughs> he actually stops by here often. Ra rather often. It's almost as if he knows the detective agency. Mm. Seriously? This dog does that? Yes, for the past few months now. He seems to take his self-appointed position quite seriously. He sounds kind of like Amasawa. <laughs> Why is he wandering around town, though? He's a collar, so he's obviously not just Hi. stray. And therein lies the mystery of this dog. He's very well trained and the perfect specimen of health. No one's seen him rooting around in garbage or anything. So based on this information, it's clear that he has someone taking care of him. Or he's a god dog. The mystery chasing dog's a big mystery himself, huh? <gasps> oh my god! Mm -hmm. Huh? <sighs> Something wrong, boy? Oh, he's picked up the scent of a mystery. I believe he wants you to follow him, Miyagmishi. Oh. Right. Uh, am, am I supposed to hold the leash? <laughs> yeah, he just has he just has proper leash manners is all. <sighs> I guess he really is that smart. I can see why he's walking around freely. <laughs> Pick up the leash, Yagamishi. Go right now. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I thought it was supposed to be the adventures of Mr. Kitty. No, Mr. Kitty gone now. It's just me. What is he? Want me to take you for a walk? 
Look for squirrels. Y'all gonna be sheep. Oh, squirrels. Fucking squirrels. Why didn't you say so? Yeah, squirrels. <laughs> I fucking race ahead. What the hell? This guy more excited about squirrels than I am. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she, I believe he's requesting you to partner up with him. <laughs> Are you willing to accept the case? I already have my hands full with the MRC. I have to take care of this detective dog, too. The Nani the fuck is going on? A new partner. Okay, okay. I'll take the case. Where's the trouble, boy? Bark, bark. Yes, yes. Okay, lead the way. You're not just taking me to get you food, are you? <laughs> hey. Guess I'm not taking point on this case. I should follow him, right? So he knows the way. <gasps> okay, doggy, where are you going? Can we run or? Oh, we can't. Oh my God, look at him go. Look at his little chunky thighs. <laughs> Oh my god. I had this guy in my college that, that uh uh that works there, this old guy. He had a Shiba dog. He always sat outside the dining hall whenever I went to go eat. He had a big blue tongue too. I don't know I, I don't know if it's just some or all actually I don't think this dog had a blue tongue, did he? I think like some Shibas have blue tongues. Okay, where are we going to Oh okay, we're going this way. Oh, I see a child. Yeah, this dog definitely doesn't seem to have one. Mm -hmm. Is this really leading me? Unless the, maybe maybe it's not the same breed I'm thinking of. I, I think Sheba, some Sheba said blue tongues. Oh uh, mm. boy, mm, this is an issue. You don't know how to get in touch with her. Uh. No, she just said said away here. This should be back for me soon. Oh dear, this is not good. Uh, no. uh, excuse me, is there some sort of trouble? We got a doggo here, and you are Takiki Yagami, a detective from Kamarocho. <laughs> oh, what a cute doggy! Uh. Is yeah, something the matter here? Mm. Well, he's been waiting in front of a facility for a while now because his mother told him to wait here. Facility? Yeah, so our orphanage's is main facility is upstairs. Hmm. And you say he was left here and the mother doesn't seem to be returning. Okay. Yes, and uh, he actually had this envelope with him when I first came out to ask if anything was wrong. Some kind of letter? It says, please take care of Shusuke chan. Mm. Ah, I see. Uh, I, think your <laughs> I, th I think your mom's gone, kid. Please take care of Shusuke chan. He's a very good boy. He loves banana ice cream. He means the world to me. So much so that I'm going to leave his ass here. At the very least, I was hoping to learn why he's here, being dropped off without any hint of knowing the truth. That's no way to treat a person. Hey, Shusuke kun, right? How long has your mom been gone? 18 years. What? Like an hour? That's true. There's a slight chance you could still be nearby. Got a hunter ass down. Yagami son, was it? You're a detective, aren't you? Could you possibly find his mother? <laughs> yes, yeah, so you just immediately knew I was one, huh? I really would like to, but. Say, did your mother mention anything at all about where she might be going? Mm. I don't know. Okay, how about her name? What's her name? I don't know. <laughs> really? Mikan Shibuya Mikan. How much I can do with just that, though? <laughs> but the dog will know. Hmm? What is it? Where's the boy? Where is it? I smell Scooby Snacks! You just in the letter, boy? He's got stuff in. <laughs> oh, you think you can track her by the scent of the envelope? <laughs> this dog's smarter than I am. Well, if the dog's as much of a detective as Sakuma made him out, sound like he is. I suppose I should let him t take a crack at it. All right, track this scent for me, will ya? <laughs> Dude, I can't wait to customize my dog. Okay, lead the way. We're going this way. <laughs> oh my god. You're going this way now. Hey, how's it going? I'm a random thug guy. <laughs> Curl here, Yaksa. Come on, Mika Chan. Time to get in the goddamn car. She's Kikun, was it? You gotta make that joke for his sake, right? Get in the goddamn car and make sweet love to me. And you promised to send him his share, right? <laughs> of course, will me, Kanchan. Once you pay back with you, that is. You have a debt to pay. And don't, and no funny business on your end either. <laughs> Woof. Ooh. Is that her, boy? Huh? Eh, what's your problem, huh? Go sit out a bone somewhere else, you dumb dumb. Shoot. I know. You're Shusuke Kun's mom, right? Mikan Shibuya? Uso. Not even the fuck, I've been gone for like two seconds. How do you know that? Okay, I'm looking for you after this dog. Let me to your son. To your son? Didn't expect to run into this guy too, but now I see what's going on. He needs to be beat up. 
Doggo, get him. What if I get some heat access to the dog? That'd be awesome. Dog, let you? My guess is you owe someone enough money that this scumbag's trying to drag you off to work some unsavory job for the rest of your life. A brawler or something, probably. What? I mean... Uh, happens all the time at Camarocho, where I work. Ah, uh, uh, what? The fuck is your deal, asshole? Come on. I don't come to your job and talk shit about how you blackmail people. You're getting in the way of company business. Don't be surprised when you need it. I already heard you say she owes you. How much does she owe by, she owe by now? What interest are you charging? She bought 500 grand with the interest that's 9 mil. You plan on covering her for something? Come on, Tucker. Okay, see, that's an exorbitant rate. I knew I was looking at a loan shark from the first moment. I think I'll be leaving with Mikan-san now. Do I need to knock you out first or no? Fuck you, man. We got it first. No, you know what? I'm gonna ice you and you and your money. My dog here? Uh, Blaze over there. Dog, where'd you go? The dog abandoned me. Damn it. I was really hoping there'd be some fucking heat action with the dog. Damn, get fucked. Ah. Uh, that guy's fucking dick. Uh, high kick. High kick. High kick. High kick. Come here. Show me your power. Ow, fuck. Ow, oh, they show me their power. What the hell? What are you doing? Slap your ass in front of me. Come here. Fuck, come here. Come here. There was one I got uh, recently, a heat action for the tiger style for like a stunned opponent. Is there any attacks I have that actually stun opponents like right off the bat? I don't think I, I don't think there is. Oh wait, uh, gain the chance to stun enemies on throws. Grab enemies with circle and square. All right, let's give this a try. Get square, shit, grab. I'm not actually grabbing you. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's time. Oh my God, it's still going. That ah, was such overkill. Well, that was awesome. Ow. Hey, motherfucker. All right, I need to remember, uh, I can actually charge my moves now. With my snake stock, I keep forgetting I can do that. I haven't really fucked around with it much. Yeah, fuck. No. So you want to talk about treating people as property is illegal? What? What? I'm fully licensed lawyer. I'd be happy to take your, her case pro bono. Why don't we sit down for a little chat? Ah, shit, fuck me. Screw this. Ah. So is, is that it? <sighs> How'd it get so bad, Mikan-san? Huh? She's kicking and still waiting for you at the orphanage. You thought you were going to come back for him. Ah, oh, man, I suck. <sighs> they said if I didn't go with that man, they'd, they'd still shusuke off to someone. So that's why... Somebody. Is your panic enough to agree to do what they said? <sighs> yes, I... It's so terrible. On, That's the sort of thing loan sharks will do. They figure out how to pressure you enough that you break. Next thing you know, they own you outright. Hello. I know a good lawyer in Kamurocho would be happy to help you. She'll reach out to her for you. Please, yes. Sweet, just give me some money. <laughs> now there's a stick up, all right? I'm not letting you go see your son to give me some money too. Mom, you're back. What the fuck? Why are you sobbing? Where's my toy? Where's my Taco Bell, Mom? I'm sorry. I'm yes, so yes. sorry. Good job, boy. Who's a good fucking omniscient doggy? Who's a good omniscient doggy? I wish we had a heat action together, though. Mm. But what are you doing, really? Got the whole town talking about you now. Don't you have a home? Where's your home? <laughs> my home's right here. I scratch my ear. Jeez, boy. What should you tell me? Oh, yeah, my son, I have a huge favor to ask. I'll pay you if I ha if I have to. Please, find Rampo for me. Oh, my God. It's her dog. Rampo? The old mystery author? I'm oh, sorry. Rampo's the name of our dog, but he's a big mystery lover, too. He gets away from the house to go solve them sometimes. <laughs> this makes a lot of sense. Let me send you a picture. Ah, <laughs> oh, look at them. Ah, oh, look at them. It's so funny. <laughs> that said, though, where the hell did you take this picture, Amasala? Down in the ghetto. Oh. I should have known. Too bad he's my dog now. 
So you're Amasawa's dog, huh? Just had to break away from the family and make a name for yourself, huh? Hmm, can't say I'm surprised, though. They say pets and their owners grow more and more alike over the pe over the years. But this is... Whatever. I should get in touch with Amasawa. Ne Yagami-san! Yagami-san! So sorry you had to deal with Rampo. Hey! Rampo! You, li you listen? No wandering off on your own. How much have I told if I told you? <laughs> He's like, ah, fine. You'll never behave, will you? Yeah. Ah, he seems like a good boy to me, aren't you? Mm. Yagami-san, well, he does seem rather fond of you. Rampo's usually more wary of strangers. Masako. And he sees you more as a professional partner, Yagami-san. Really? You think so? Damn, this dog's smart. <laughs> I went to college. Of course you did. Eh. Indeed I do. In fact, I've been raising him as a proper investigatory partner ever since he was a puppy. Uh huh? Huh? What do you mean by that? Eh, what does that even mean? Oh, um, when I was little, I read a book about a detective girl whose dog helped crack her crack a case. Don't want to finish that book. I start training Rampo to help me solve mysteries. So you're why he's always sniffing out trouble. Eh. Yes, it seems he's gotten quite hooked on it. Whenever he smells an incident brewing, he's off and running. We try to keep him inside the house, but she's too good at slipping out. So um, is that okay? Like, with the animal shelters and police? <laughs> no, it very much is not. Rip has been caught several times by both groups, and I have to be the one who picks up and picks him up and apologizes every time. He's becoming quite a familiar face at the shelter, unfortunately. But he doesn't bite, and even tries to help people out. So they're a lot more lenient with him than they are supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> you two really are alike, huh? <laughs> what? I think so? No. You know, you really did train him well. I think you'd be willing to help me again if you we ran across each other in town. Oh. Well, uh, I suppose so. You could always start calling for him, at least. If he's around and feels like helping, you may get lucky. You're living your best life, aren't you, boy? <laughs> woof, woof. Away he goes. Ah, Rampo, no! Sorry, Yagami-san, I have to go. Where did my leash go? <laughs> just, like, vanished out of my hand. I just let it go. <laughs> Good luck with the case. I should try calling for Rampo next time. I need his nose for an investigation. Well, there's no guarantee he'll come running. <laughs> New gadget acquired in the form of dog. Uh, detectives knows the dog. Not so much a gadget as a living being with a mind and feelings. It's important to remind yourself of these things. By utilizing his incredible sense of smell, he can track odorous evidence for you. Based on how far you are in the story, he may run off on his own to track a scent. Following him would be a good idea. Call for your canine by accessing the dog app from the gadgets. Cool. Detective dog acquired. However, I'm totally going to change his color. I'm going to change his color to Bernie colors because I got that from the DLC. Uh, let's see. How do I do that? Is it in here? Maybe? Uh, so this going to be something I can equip here. I know I've got a little black doggy one. I know I've got one. Or maybe I can do it. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> He's just waiting. Uh, guess I got the leash. Recall, recall dog. I guess that means get, let him have him leave. How do I? How do I switch him out? An investigation. Okay, so he just kind of goes anywhere right now. But he might, he might sniff something out. He does seem to be. Oh God, he just kind of pull a bit, doesn't he? <laughs> Kind of random directions. Uh, all right, I got a hug bomb too. Hug me. I was thinking, say the the shapes of the the DLC dogs are actually a little different. Look, like this is the regular one, but then these ones are a bit floofier. Actually, like a slightly different body shape and different tail too. So a Akita, a Kurashiba, and a Kaiken, a rare breed, also known as the Tiger Dog. This is the one I want. It's as close to Bernie's I can I can get here. I don't know how to equip him though. Maybe I gotta do it like the office or something. Oh, okay. Hold on. I decided to look it up because it was. I was like, "Oh no!" <laughs> okay, so let me end here. Now, if I head back to Yokohama 99. Oh shit! I just walked into a cutscene, didn't I? I think the dog's supposed to be in here, and if I interact with him, I can change change his color. Nanda kore, nani yatte no? Ah! Oh, okari. Take a bear. 
クアナはお前に用があって来てるんだぜまあ酒も将棋も嫌でやってるわけじゃねえがよ回答はどっちもつるのか歯ごたえがある俺に用事って何 Stop stealing my friends for me 聞いたぜヤガミさんあんたミコシバヒロって例の大学生殺しを調べてんだってハンピンリューマンに襲われたのもそのせいだったんだろ俺にも一枚かませろよ悪いけど手は足りてんだよその探偵が地元の殺し調べてんのにこの俺がのけもんそいつはいただけないな手が止まってるよ早く勝負を終わらせて会員になって地元に詳しい味方が必要だろ俺なら偉人町の裏の裏まで案内できるでもお高いんでしょ初回は安くしといてもいいよそのご同業に手柄独り占めされるのだけはごめんなんだよあんたが首を縦に振るまでここで頑張らせてもらうつくもと杉浦がいいんなら別にここはオレンジじゃないし僕はウェルカムですぞたまにはナースケモンナースストバックミアダメ僕も全然居心地いいなこの事務所は<笑> This is my home now スマックあ、ヤガミシネットの掲示板でエハラのことが取り上げられてますぞ自殺した息子さんのためにいじめっ子を殺してたんじゃないかとマジかもうそこまで見てくだされどうぞこちらへはい。Yeah! There he is! I'm going to change this dog's breed real quick Which dog will you take out in the town? The black one <laughs> We cried? I'm sorry. I guess technically this is a different dog then. Wait, you're not the one I wanted. I mean, I guess you're black, but the I guess rust. <laughs> What am I doing? Wait, no, the dog's name is still Rampo. Uh, anyway, yes, this is definitely the one I want. Let's go for a walk. Walk the dog. You won't be able to play mini games or visit any stores. Yeah, Whatever, guys. See you later. I got my doggo here. Yeah. It really kind of blends into the night. Uh, oh, that's cute. I have a little flashlight at nighttime on the end of my uh, leash. That's a nice little detail. Mm, I got my little Bernie dog. Bernie Sheba. Actually, it, it's just the... It, I guess it was just the way the the pictures looked in the menu, but it, it looked like their shape was different. It, it actually isn't. No, they're, they're still they're still Sheba. Just different, just different color. Yeah. All right, you're gonna be this color forever now. This <laughs> one's still kind of like, he whippers like, oh my God, what did I do? What did I do? All right. Uh, so I'm guessing, I don't know if I, if I can just walk around randomly and he'll find stuff or, or what? It seems like it'd be a lot of randomly walking around to just stumble across things with your dog. And I'm not, I'm not actually going super fast. I'm hoping there's at least some like indication like, hmm. This seems like something I'd want to whip my dog out for something. I, I don't know how exactly that'd work, but otherwise it could take some time. By the way, I think I got some skills. All right, let's do the uh, knockdown reversal. Can cancel a knockdown that would toss you back and turn it into a reversal attack. Try will be knocked back. So it's not really being knocked down. It's being like pushed back, I guess. I guess this chapter is not ending as quickly as I thought it would. I'm assuming we're having some other things going on here. Oh, he's a good little Bernie dog. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Oh, wait, what does this guy have to say? Ma, Tante ga hoi hoi, irai o share de guinea tenua, tozen wakateru. Sono we de son wa sasene yot de hanashida. Mae muki ni kangai de migre. Are you drinking my beer, damn it? Can you cases? Oh. Well, I guess I'll talk to Sakuma instead. Cho iku di shu se wa kako ni izime di satsu o hiki o kosta. Psychopas mi kosiba. エハラは痴漢の皮をかぶった正義。いろいろありますな。<笑>これって結構騒ぎになってる。今まさにバルタがこの話題に火をつけようとしてる。といったところでしょうか。その誰かって、もしかしてミコシバを殺したやつだ。そう判断するのはまだ早いかもしれませんがね。そっか。ただ、気になる書き込みもあります。エハラが裁判中、ミコシバの死体発見を言い当てたとその件はこれまでゴシップ誌ですら取り上げてなかったのにそうだったんだ
マスコミもお茶の間も痴漢で捕まったハレンチ警官を叩けるだけ叩けた、うん、それでもニュースとして旬が終わったんでしょう後の裁判でどんなやり取りがあろうと気に留められませんだからそういう話に俺も混ぜてくれって三越場を殺したのは複数犯なのかそんなヤバいのがこの町で野放しになってんのかよもう2ヶ月前の話だ今この町にいるとは限らないし今日も偉人町は平和だったろああ、ブーあ、マイファキンウィンドウエマショギボー外からだあ、ス、ピースシェッハンピンリューマンまた白面だ行くぞターボ行くぞお先にスクリューステーズやるね What a badass Time to chase him down. Let's go, Yagami. Mateo! I'm gonna kick this ball right in your fucking face. Woo! I'm right next to you. Come on. Oh shit, fight! <laughs> Code, oh come on! This is what I get. Sounds like the game didn't give you. I was expecting a prompt there, but it didn't give it to me. Some games, games like no, you should have. You should have just used your joystick, I guess. Could have run to the right of me, dude. It was a pretty wide open spot. Bonk. Now kick it again. Get another one of these. Bicycle. All right, let's do it again. Oh, dude, really? Again? All right, fucking die. Hey, we're in this area. Ow. <laughs> we're in this area. I was wondering what it, what it existed for. You guys remember? Yeah, I knew I was sorry, shit. I remarked how cool the lighting was here. And it still is cool. <laughs> like I ate shit right before I caught him. Okay, nobody saw that. <sighs> Starting to rain. <laughs> oh shit, it was all according to plan. Fucking music. Hamerita. Anshina. Inochima de Toledo, you are a tene. Janan de comment Yokohama Luming White Mask Branch Leader Tesso. Oh god. Anytime I deal with a, a Yakuza bad guy with Wolverine claws, it always leads to a pain in the ass fight. ただ。Oh god. Oh, fuck me. Oh god, oh god, woo! Do you see that dodge? Oh 
Ah, damn it. Oh, God, I'm bleeding. Ah, oh, that motherfucker. I am bleeding a lot. Oh, hey, I've got uh, stuff here. Let's see if I can't get a move that I could potentially use on you. Uh, additional strike during X boost with parry. Oh, yeah, motherfucker. That's right. You got some shell me. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Come on. Uh. Oh. What? Oh, I had two things. Oh, come on. I wasn't ready. Oh. What the hell? I wasn't used to having multiple button presses. Uh. I'm in the red, which means time for power. Uh. 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 Come on. Ow. <laughs> Come on. This ends now. Ah! It's the power of my Kyle kit. Okay, so we have multiple button presses for the, some of these qu uh, quick time events now. <gasps> oh, my friends are here. <laughs> it's about damn demon time. What? Right. Yeah. Not okay. <laughs> that was funny. Oh shit, we're not done. Oh god. Oh, uh, okay. We want to decide we're going to do this, huh? All right, well. You know what that means, guys? Here we go. This ends here. Still the best crowd control move there is. That's the shit. Oh, bouncing around like fucking ragdolls. Yeah, fuck you. Ah, uh. oh, damn it. Bitch, wow. Tama, Michiwa, get us I'm coming. Wait. Hey, I see some shit. Oh, hey, what's that? Oh, some sweet healing, baby. Oh, wait. I probably should keep an eye out for, like, uh, skill books or something. Because apparently we're, like, in a dungeon now. Oh, God. Strong guy. Uh, holy shit. Uh, uh, power. This is my fucking perk. Damn, the charge text do so much fucking damage. I love it. Come on. Oh, shit. Damn, I just want to take like, a fucking nail with a, with a milk crate. Need some help, buddy? No. I got this guy. I learned this in the fucking boxing gym. Come on. Ah, right hook. Wait, let me check down here. I'm gonna make sure I didn't uh, miss anything. You guys, uh, just gonna hang out? It's gonna, it's like, ah, we're not gonna help. We're just gonna, gonna watch. Oh, hey. I see you. Actually, I guess that's, was that the way I was supposed to go? I guess it is. Hi, folks. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm bleeding. Uh, this move is turning out to be uh, incredibly helpful. How often I'm knocking my fucking ass. No, no mercy. Ah, shit, I could have I killed him with a... With a... Mercy move. Oh, yeah. Time for some speed. Oh, shit. Let's fucking go, dude. Oh, break through his magic. Woo! Oh, shit. Let's go. Ow. Ow. I wasn't ready. Oh, shit. What the hell? Why do you have as much health as the guy as your boss at his feet? Uh-oh, uh-oh. You block asshole. Whatever. Get up. I'll take you. This guy out of the way. So I killed your friend. Now you're next. Fuck you, dude. Oh my god, that damage. That's it. I've had it up to here with you. This ends now. Wasn't quite the move I was expecting to do there, but that works. Is that all the techno you guys got? Nice socks, dickhead. どうも。褒められついでにさ。あんたらの雇い主のことを教えてくんない。言ったろ。あいにくそんなもんには興味がない。じゃあせめて次また同じ依頼が来たら断ってくれよ。お前がこの町を出て行けば済むことだ。同じ
を渡すように言われました最後の警告だもう嗅ぎ回るなと These motherfuckers ずっと見られてたのかくそ狙うなら俺を狙えよ多分さっきのハンピン・リューマンたちはおとりだ俺らをこの事務所から引き離すためのなまんまと引っかかっちまった So we are as fucking dead. <sighs> oh, wow. Okay, we're still going. I, I thought the chapter was going to end there. Just got to tape up these windows. This is the camera that I'm checking out. Look at me. I'm and Kaido. I'm going to take a look at the camera. The problem is... What the hell? Oh god, new mask guys. I mean, different mask guys are gonna be. Oh, what the hell? They're wearing the fucking Joker mask or something. Oh, that's マジか。ただ、こんなにたくさんの人間が殺しに関われるもんか。うん。どういう意味だ。仲間が多ければ、その分秘密も漏れやすくなる。一人裏切れば、芋づる式で警察に捕まんだ。よほど信頼関係がな
I need some long trail on the beach, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Did we get any new jobs? We actually didn't, did we? Oh, wait. Yeah, we did. Find our runaway game director. Tashi, Takeshi Oshi, Okizaki. My name is Takeshi Okizaki. I work for a certain game development company. <laughs> We're just going to end up being like not subtly Sega or something. The director of our current project ran off right before we could finish the master version. We simply can't do it without him. We tried to find him, but his experience making espionage games made him surprisingly hard to find. Oh, is this going to be like some fucking Hideo Kojima reference or something? I'd like to hire you to catch our director, Yagami-san. Sorry to ask this, but would you be willing to meet me at Wet Kitchen on Eisezaki Road? I'll be working from there so we can rendezvous more easily. So he needs me to hunt down a video game director? Pretty unusual job. I guess I should heal the client out. Now where'd my music go? Oh, I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. Dude, I need to clean myself the fuck off. Nah, never mind. I'm gonna go do some side quests. <laughs> oh, can I actually do that while I'm all bloodied up? Apparently. No, this won't be distracting at all. <laughs> Flight of the game creator. That's funny. All right, nothing new aside from that. That's uh, popped up here. Wow, okay. That actually ended up being a lot more extensive than I thought. I thought I'd just go right to uh, find Ihara, but uh, not quite. Um, but all right, guys. I think this is actually probably a good place then to uh, end things here for now. Uh, but next episode, I'm assuming we'll go interview him, maybe? Ass assuming nobody comes and breaks into my office again. Also, seriously, I gotta clean myself up. Could you seriously imagine me going into cutscenes like this or like side quests and I'm talking to with my face all fucked up like this? It's even worse than it was last time. Before it was like some scratches. I just kind of looked a little like unpleasant, but this is like, I look like I've killed somebody. <laughs> and everyone's just gonna talk to me all casually like, like, oh yeah, it's going on. Like no nothing wrong with it. Definitely not immersion breaking. Not at all. Uh, but anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe. And already become Peaky Penguin aboard the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.